brother has obtained the lands of Shu. Now he'll be able to stand on equal footing with Cao Cao and Sun Quan. I think this calls for a drink. But we can't just sit and celebrate. Guan Yu has taken some troops from Jing in an effort to attack Fawn Castle in Xiongyang. Normally, we'd have nothing to fear. But this time, Cao Cao and Sun Quan have joined forces against us. I must use my strength to help brother. Zhang Fei, the situation is very serious. Protecting Fawn Castle is none other than Cao Ren. With his strong defense, this should be a tough battle even for Guan Yu. Fearful of Guan Yu, Wei formed an alliance with Wu. They have dispatched many capable officers, such as Lu Meng and Lu Shun to Jing. If they join together to try and trap him, the land of Jing and Guan Yu himself are vital to Liu Bei realizing his dreams for the land. Zhang Fei, it is up to you to go and save them from this predicament. Those rats from Wu are after my brother! If they're planning a water attack, they'll do it soon. Blast! I'm coming, brother! Just hold on! We made it! Now where are those fellows from Wu? We'll flood Fan Castle with a water attack. Hold the front. Keep strict watch over the floodgates. Good luck if you think you can break through our defenses. Out of my way! Not enough! That's another one down!
take the base! Stop them! Hero of our time! I shall teach you the basic strategy. Is this how I'm to meet my end? That's another one down! The river's gonna overflow any second now! Waters of war, rush forth to devour Fawn Castle! Oh. Now's our chance! All units advance on Fawn Castle! Defend this castle if it's the last thing I do. Them. They're trying to take the base! Stop them! <laughs> My duty is to defend this castle. Therefore, I will have to destroy you. Let's see how you like my power. You wild beast! My strength will put a stop to you. Bring it on, then! I'd like to see you try! I have some catching up to do. These boats are our path to glory! Charge! So, this battlefield is to serve as my tomb. That's another one down! Everybody, we must not fall behind! We 
have a chance to win this. Here I am, everyone. Shu Huang has arrived. Time to see what you are made of. Is this how the war is That's another one down! chance to win this. You must not value your life so high. Out of my way! Nothing like the chaos of the land. That's another one down! Fawn Castle has fallen to our forces. We overcame the courage of Kao Ren and the wisdom of Lu Mei. I must thank all of you for your hard work. Brother is in charge of defending Shu, while I have been placed in charge of Jing. If we can combine our efforts, the unification of the land is within sight. Now is the time for us to create a world ruled by virtue. Thank you. 
new bodyguard has come to act in your service. This bodyguard is famous in two kingdoms as a veteran of great ability. When the Han Dynasty saw its end, its demise ushered in a new era of chaos, brought on by several regional lords vying to rule China. There were those who sought absolute power, as well as those who fought for justice, and some simply fought for the sake of their beliefs. Many would rise and fall in their attempts to dominate the land. Zhang Fei from the land of Zhuo, a powerful warrior said to be a match for 10,000 men. He was also known to have a strong sense of justice. A lover of wine, he often became very violent when drinking. Zhang Fei would later meet Liu Bei and Guan Yu during the Yellow Turban Rebellion. The three warriors swore an oath of brotherhood amidst a grove of blossoming peach trees and agreed to put an end to the chaos together. Despite not having a land to call their own, Zhang Fei supported Liu Bei in all of his campaigns. In 208 AD, at the Battle of Changban, it was Zhang Fei who rescued Liu Bei from danger. Fighting as the rear guard, he successfully frightened off Cao Cao's troops by giving a powerful shout, allowing Liu Bei and his people to escape to safety. After overcoming many arduous battles, Liu Bei was finally able to establish his kingdom of Shu. Zhang Fei was then appointed as one of the Five Tiger Generals, thereby solidifying his position as one of the mightiest warriors in the land. The chaos continues throughout the Three Kingdoms. However, Zhang Fei will not rest until he has achieved what he and his brothers swore at the Peach Garden. These tales, long forgotten in the flows of time, are about the legends of which no one can recall. to get started. Bring them on! Hey, Zhang Fei! We'll crush all those that stand in my way! 